Hello, no more hero seven, and today I have another Pokemon Showdown double battle. This battle, man, I made a lot of bad plays in this battle. Like, oh my god, I really, I am really an idiot. I made a lot of mistakes in this battle, and but I really like it because it was really close and it's. Overall, it's just outright fun. So, enough with the talk. Let's just get to the battle. Alright, so he starts off with his uh, Obama Snow and his Chandelure, while I start off with my Reuniclus and my Amoongus. I switch out my Reuniclus, trying to predict if he's going for the Shadow Ball, so I send out my Porygon too. Uh, I go for the Protect on my Amoongus in case of, you know, the Heat Wave and the Blizzard. He goes for the heat wave, and unfortunately my Porygon 2 was burned and he goes for the blizzard and it did some damage but the burn really cost me here so yeah so anyways I switch out my Amoongus predicting another heat wave uh, that's how my thought process is so now he goes for the heat wave and which he did and I also predict the to blizzard so now yeah unfortunately my Porygon 2 was knocked out so now my first priority is really is to set up the team. So I send back the Unicus. I switch out my Jellicent and send in Mawel. But here it's a stupid move because for once I knew why would I do that? I switch out a Steel type on a Fire type, which is stupid of me. So now I lost my Mega. So now I go for the Giga Drain and finally I get to set up a Trick Room. So now I send in Rhyperior. He goes for the Protect thinking of an Earthquake or a Shadow Ball. So I go for Shadow Ball which is the safest play and it didn't work since he used Protect. Go for the Mega Horn and it did massive damage but unfortunately Obama Snow leaves, goes for Gear 3, times for super effective and takes out my Rhyperior. So now he switched out his Chandelure and send in his T-Tart thinking of a uh, Shadow Ball. So yeah I go for side track on Obama Snow but unfortunately Obama Snow outsweared Jellicent on Trick Room so now Jellicent is gone because of the uh, Giga Drain. No, I have no choice, but I'm forced to send out my Amoongus. He switches out his uh, Obama Snow, thinking, yeah. Anyways, I go for the Giga Drain, didn't work. And it seems he switched out. Oh, and I was able to knock out his uh, <laughs> his uh, Tyranitar with Focus Blast, because I was really hoping it would knock him out. I was hoping it would hit, and it did hit. So which is lucky me. Anyways, I go for Psy Shock and take out his Obama Snow. I go for Spore so I can uh, put his Chandelure to sleep. So right now the hail damage. So now my Trick Room is gone. Um, anyways, I go for Rage Powder in case of incoming attacks because I really need my re to set up Trick Room. He goes for Knock Off and knocks off my, uh, uh, what do you call that? Black Sludge. So I really made a good play there. So, but anyways, I finally set up Trick Room. So now I was able to take out his Reuniclus with Shadow Ball, which is the safest play. And I put his Conkelder to sleep so that he won't do anything. And thank goodness it's not a Guts Conkelder. Otherwise, I'm in deep trouble. But enough about that. Uh, he sends out his Magnezone. He goes for the Protect on his Magnezone, predicting um, <laughs> a Spore. But nope, I go for the Rage Powder just in case of incoming attacks. And I go for the side shock just so I can take out his Conkelder, but unfortunately he wasn't able to get the knockout. So his Conkelder is still asleep. I put use four on his Magnezone. Uh, I use side shock, and I was able to knock out his Conkelder. And his Magnezone is still asleep, and the heal is finally gone. So now here's really the fun part. He goes, he sends out his Carver. He goes for protect. I go for the focus last. Hoping that it won't miss, and it didn't, and it was able to knock out that uh, Magnezone. But unfortunately, Spore didn't work because of the Protect. So here I go for the Rage Powder, so i predicting that he'll go for the Shadow Ball, but unfortunately no. He predicted that and goes for the uh, Psy Shock. So anyways, what happened is, he uses uh, I go for Shadow Ball, gets super effective damage, and he goes for Dazzling Beam and knocks out my... Uh, Reuniclus and the match was over. It was very close despite the bad plays and yes the bad plays Yes, I am a freaking idiot. I shouldn't have done a lot of it So a lot of those things 
Yeah, really missed predictions and all of that. But despite that, I see this battle is really fun and intense, and I hope I want to see more of those. I hope I get to uh, just. Uh. Anyways, this is No More Heroes saying if you like the video, be sure to subscribe and also share it so it can really help my channel. That's all, and I hope you all have a good day.